Hello there guys, today we're looking at a Mercedes from 1977 and it's not just any Mercedes, it's the 6.9, I believe it's the biggest Mercedes engine that they ever produced. It's a pretty cool car, it's from 1977 and we're gonna take it for a short drive. But before we go driving, I'm gonna take you on a lap around the car. Have a look at the inside. As you can see, uh, this is an American car, or maybe you could not see, but uh, the wheels on the car is a little bit blinged out, which they, it was quite common they did in America. And you have a white stripe on the tires. It used to have a different set of bumpers, but they have been changed for the European style. On the inside, the car is super nice, really clean interior. All the wood panels are really good. It's got power windows on all four. It's got a sunroof and we got an air condition. Gonna pop the hood for you, show you how it looks there. As I said, this is an American version, so it has slightly less horsepower than the European. But I would say you have to look more for car to car to find and feel those last horsepower that this car might be missing towards a European model. So now we are in uh, Germany because we're on Autobahn and we're gonna test a little bit the performance of the car because the whole idea of buying a 6.9 is of course that you want the car with the biggest engine. Um, this car is perhaps, or it is not, perfect cosmetically on the outside. The, the upside with that is that the body is super solid. It's from a dry state in America. There's absolutely no rust on the car. And also the entire mechanics have been gone through. It has a complete new air suspension system. Um, and uh, the AC have been rebuilt. All fluids in the car, uh, rear axle, gearbox, engine, everything has been replaced. All filters have been replaced in the gearbox, fuel filter, oil filter, of course, you always replace. So we would like to say it's, a, and also many of the bushings and so on in, in the car underneath have been replaced. The exhaust system was put new. So it's a car that is really mechanically sound. Hopefully you can trust for still many years to come. Okay, we're going to bring it up. You can see now we're doing 120, about 3000 RPM. There is some uh, German drivers in the fast lane, but as soon as we get a free course, we're going to see what we can do. up to 150 there. Now the Kia is stepping away. <laughs> See now we have about 4000 RPM. We're doing 170. Yeah, this is pretty much sums it up for the 6.9. Super cool, luxurious car from the late 70s. Suits any old shake out there. Uh, if you like the video, please, as you know, always click like and please subscribe to our channel. Until next time, take care.